Wind is the breath of the earth. Spanning an impressive 2,500 kilometers, Tian Shan Mountains are a vast mountain range that winds through the heart of Asia. The central and eastern Tian Shan extend for hundreds of kilometers like two colossal arms, gathering the winds from the field and the basin. These compressed winds continue to accelerate through an extraordinary canyon, traveling unhindered across the almost barren Gobi Desert. Eventually, in the 80-kilometer-long valley, the winds continue to converge, forming powerful energy. Towering to the sky, the wind turbines cut through the ages of silence in the desolate plains with their blades. Thousands of wind turbines stand in formation, creating a spectacular white forest in Daban Cheng district of Urumqi in northwest China's Xinjiang. Each year, Daban Cheng wind zone experiences more than 200 days of strong winds of six on the Beaufort scale. The area suitable for installing wind turbines covers 1,500 square kilometers. The annual wind energy potential here amounts to a staggering 25 billion kilowatt hours. If converted into electricity, it could illuminate the world for 30 minutes or serve one person for 950,000 years. Massive blades gracefully spin, turning wind's hidden force into a ceaseless source of green electricity. Like the release of oxygen, the white forest of wind turbines in Daban Cheng, dubbed China's Wind Valley, generates green winds, supplying essential energy for modern economic society. Huang Jianxin, a 74-year-old acclaimed painter in China, is known for creating large-scale murals for the Xinjiang Hall of the Great Hall of the People. Yet, one of his most remarkable and unique works of art is a relatively small oil painting he crafted 34 years ago at the Da Ban Cheng Wind Farm. In October 1989, with the first batch of wind turbines gifted by Denmark began operation in Da Ban Cheng, China's first large-scale wind farm was born. Ten years later, domestically manufactured wind turbines were introduced in Da Ban Cheng. Another decade passed, and China's wind power capacity surpassed that of the United States in 2010, propelling it to the top position in the world. In 2022, China's grid-connected wind power capacity exceeded 300 gigawatts, doubling in just five years. Wind turbines with 40 times the power output of the initial ones now blanket the valley, being constructed is a type of 6.7 megawatt colossus, towering as high as a 30-story building. When running at full capacity for one hour, it can power an electric vehicle to circumnavigate the Earth's equator or supply a household with electricity for five years. <laughs> Behind the development of wind power lies relentless technological challenges and arduous construction. Engineers from across the country persevered in the face of difficulties, working in the fierce winds of the Gobi Desert in Daban Cheng. They measured wind forces, dug trenches, and climbed wind turbines, all with the determination to create China's own wind turbines. Interconnected power grids along with the rapid expansion of ultra-high voltage transmission corridors characterized as green, efficient, safe, and smart, are accelerating the establishment of China's new power system and new energy system. I'm a government and a government consumer, and I'm experiencing a strong change in the change of energy and energy. I believe the percentage of new energy in the 
中国绿色发展的理念正日益影响着我们每一个人。我们都是亲历者，也是受益者。Today, Da Ban Cheng District runs entirely on new energy. The vast wind turbines with close to zero carbon emissions protect wetlands, snow-capped mountains, and the well-being of tens of thousands of locals. Burumchi, located approximately 90 kilometers from Da Ban Cheng, is home to a population of 4 million. Streets and buildings in the city are illuminated by green electricity. Businesses, factories, and international logistics centers are tapping into green energy benefiting more and more people. At the 19th Asian Games in East China's Hangzhou, all competition venues were 100% powered by green energy. 170 million kilowatt hours of green electricity came from Xinjiang. In the vast northern plains, the southern mountain ranges, and the southeastern coasts of China, wind farms have brought abundant green energy, and at the same time, crafted picturesque scenes for the land. Through more than three decades of endeavor, China's Wind Valley has paved the way for green electricity and driven an energy revolution that showcases Chinese wisdom in green transformation and environmental protection.